Konnichiwa, it's Koneko here, and today is another Feature Friday video. Before I get into the video, if you haven't already, please consider becoming a part of this magical pastel online family by clicking the subscription button down below. So I have one pastel thing and two non-pastel things that I would like to show you and a pastel art that I would like to show you. And the first thing that I'm going to show you is this super cute pastel blue pleated skirt. It has stretchy material on one side, a zipper down one side, and it also has safety shorts. They are just thin, but they add a little bit extra protection. And I won this off the Instagram giveaway that cutiekill.official was hosting. I will link their Instagram and their website down below. I am so happy that I have another pastel skirt to add to the collection. I have a white one also from the same shop and I really love this pastel blue one. I have a short pink one that goes with my like seifuku or schoolgirl uniform, but I would like a pink one like this as well. And the next two items are a t-shirt and a tank top from 1963, the same shop that I showed the Plus Ultra t-shirt in last Friday. So again, you can go ahead and use my discount code Koneko for them to get a discount code on your purchase. This t-shirt is a Star Wars themed t-shirt. And the next one is a My Hero Academia themed tank top. So it's a tank top this time and the sizes are both small. They really do have a wide variety of fandoms and quite a few colors to choose from. There's t-shirts and tank tops and undies and just, you know, crew necks I think they're called, like long sleeve shirts and hoodies. I'd love to get a hoodie sometime, I think. That would be super cozy for the winter coming up. But I was really happy to get this tank top since it's a black tank top. It's My Hero Academia and my Yuravity wig came in so I'd like to wear her wig with this tank top because I just think it'll look super cute. And I will also be wearing my froppy wig with this tank top and the Plus Ultra t-shirt as well just to kind of do a few different photos since both my wigs came in for those My Hero Academia characters and I'm super excited. I'm going to try to make those cosplays so I will keep you posted how that turns out. And finally, of course, the artist that I'm going to show, they drew this super adorable picture of me in my like pink seifuku again or schoolgirl outfit with my little cat ears and it says for Koneko doll from Rad Scars and it's got a little bubble heart picture as well which I'll have a picture inserted to kind of show the detail and it's very sparkly and cutesy in the background and I just love everything about this little drawing it's just so sweet thank you so so much and if you would like to have your art drawing or whatever featured in one of my Feature Friday videos, you can tag me on Instagram or Twitter or Facebook, really anywhere. And I have all my social media links in the description below and a few are shown at the end on my end slide as well. I absolutely love <laughs> getting art. Um, I just think it's so cute and so sweet that somebody took the time to look at my pictures and draw a little like chibi version of me or like, you know, a version that maybe looks more like a cat and stuff too since I really love cats and I 
love any type of art whether it's digital or traditional art and if there is any art that you do that you would like to send me for me to put up on my wall you don't have to but if you would like to my p.o box is always in my description box as well and i would also feature an actual copy of a drawing if you like this video please give it a big thumbs up so that i know that you liked it if you have any questions at all don't hesitate to leave them down below i'll get back to them as soon as i can thank you so much i hope that you enjoyed this video and I hope to see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye!